there's a couple of reasons why we choose not for the pregnant person to be sleeping during a C-section. Here's why. One, we want you to have a positive experience. When you're in a C-section, being awake to see your baby is the most beautiful and positive experience. This is ideal for the mother and baby connection. If we can get the baby onto your chest as soon as possible and even start feeding, if everything is okay with you and the baby, this is the most ideal situation. Number two, going to sleep during a C-section is not the ideal situation from a physiological standpoint. Here's why. When you are pregnant, a lot of things change. You, of course, grow in your uterus. What happens is when you grow in your uterus, you're having a lot of intra-abdominal pressure. What happens with this intra-abdominal pressure? Well, this pushes on your diaphragm. Your diaphragm is pushed upward, actually limits your lung expansion when you're breathing in and breathing out. So we don't want to compromise your oxygenation or gas exchange in any way by putting you to sleep and attempting to intubate. Number three, it's a high likelihood that pregnant women have a swollen airway. So sometimes it could be harder to place the intubation tube. Reason number four, pregnant women have a higher risk of aspiration where gastric contents come upward into the lungs. That can increase the chance of aspiration pneumonia. Reason being is because all pregnant women are considered full stomachs. That's because you have delayed gastric emptying and you have a higher acidity in your stomach. This can cause aspiration pneumonia, a higher risk of it while you are pregnant. Number five, we put you to sleep through IV medication. This goes to baby. There is placental transfer to the fetus because it's through the IV. This is why we love epidurals and spinals because the medication through the epidural and spinal has such a low, low percentage fetal transfer, it is almost negligible. And usually, sometimes baby could be very sleepy after giving mom IV sedation medication. If there are any peculiar or emergent reasons why a mother has to go to sleep for a C-section, do not fret, it happens. If it does happen, we are prepared. It is an option, it's just not the first option. But if it has to be done, we do it in a safe and timely fashion. More quick educational anesthesia tips with Funny Doc Social.